G'day everyone, Gareth here from Organic Growing Melbourne. Just wanted to share another quick tip with you. Um, the avocado is watering. As you can see, I have a sprinkler in here. There it is there. And it's sprinkling my avocado, it's watering my avocado tree. Now it's, it's extremely important um, when it comes to growing avocados. They want a lot of water, especially this time of year when they're going through full-sized mature fruit. I see one just hanging right there. Um, all the new fruitlets, plus all the new spring growth. But then again, it's also very important that you have really well drainage. Although today we've got rain, it's still 30 odd, it's about 30 degrees today. And the rain that we're getting will literally evaporate as soon as it touches the ground. So this is gonna get a good 10 more, 10 more minutes of watering and it will be watered again tomorrow. This watering is in between its um, automated irrigation that uh, waters for 20 minutes, you can see on the fence line here. But it is very, very important to make sure you water your avocados. Because if you, if you don't, and you sit, start to see the leaves wilting because they're thirsty, especially this time of year, you're gonna lose more fruit. It will drop more and more of these little fruitlets the more your tree is stressed. Um, and the worst thing you can do is not give it enough water. This time of year, you shouldn't be worried about wet feet. You still gotta have the good drainage, obviously. Because if you don't have good drainage, you wouldn't, you wouldn't get an avocado to this state, stage anyway. But they're all going to get watered. This one's already been watered. You can see it's all, the sprinkler's all flooded down here, but all these have been watered for a good 20 minutes. And like I said, this will get a good 20 minutes of, of uh, heavy watering. Make sure I, I get everywhere underneath the avocado tree so I'm feeding, all the feeder roots are getting getting the opportunity to suck in that water. Look, it comes all the way out the other side here. See? Beautiful. There we go. It's like a heavy tropical downpour this tree's getting. In this heat of 30 degrees, it is gonna thrive. It will thank me, of course, natural rain is would definitely be a better a better drenching but unfortunately in in melbourne our summers uh, can get quite dry and not have rain for months so this is extremely important so i just thought i'd share that with you thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video bye